One of our favorite things to do is turn an SVG image into a custom icon. Now this could be one that you have found from a website or one that you've created in Illustrator and turned into SVG. You can create a custom icon with that. So there are a few here that we have, you know, kind of sourced icons from. You have Spark, The Noun Project, Iconicons, and even Google Fonts has an icon panel as well. Um, there are also premium icons that you can download, and this is one of our favorites, Flat Icon. So what you're going to do is you're just going to find a an icon and just make sure that you're able to download it as an SVG. So once you have it downloaded, now you can either go to a SVG converter. So there's SVG Minifier, or there is our favorite SVG OMG. So all you're going to want to do is drag in your icon right into the panel and there are settings. I would definitely reference the show it tutorial to find the best ones because they recommend, um, you know, kind of prettifying your markup and you can see, um, some icons don't necessarily work the best because there is going to be a lot of markup copy. So, You'll definitely want to come over here to your markup or just use this little copy icon down at the bottom, copy this code. And now what we're going to do is we're going to create the icon. So this is a plain SVG that was loaded, which is fine. Um, if you're going to only load an icon, I would definitely recommend SVG because you can scale it up or down without losing the quality, but it's still, we're not able to kind of adjust the color. So now that we have our code, we're going to go ahead and add in a new icon. So this one's cute, happy face, but I want my custom icon. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to select that, go to icon settings and right here under your kind of a preview of your icon, I'm going to go ahead and click custom icon. So they also have a tutorial on how to do this as well. And then all you're going to do is you're going to paste that code into it. Now you have a happy little face that can be adjusted with the colors. So that is how we like to convert our SVG icons into um, custom icons.